Welcome to the City of Toronto's Fall Cankerworm Banding Tutorial. Emerging as caterpillars in the spring, fall cankerworm can be an aggressive defoliator of many species of plants and trees. Red oak trees are especially susceptible to damage in naturalized or forested areas. Fall cankerworm can be noticed yearly, but population explosions can happen every 10 to 15 years. Fall cankerworm moths begin emerging from mid to late October and can be noticed well into December. Wingless females crawl up the tree to lay their eggs. Applying a sticky band around target trees at this time can help catch female fall cankerworm and reduce potential populations for the following spring. Following these instructions can help you install efficient banding traps yourself. Some of the tools you require are a measuring device for the circumference of the tree trunk, cotton or quilt batting to wrap around the entire tree, cellophane or packing wrap, the stick is optional. Packing tape. A dispenser helps. Tree tangle foot. This is used to create a sticky barrier that the moths get stuck to. A spatula or rounded putty knife. And very importantly, rubber gloves. Because things can get sticky. With these tools, you'll become a cankerworm banding superstar. Start by measuring the circumference of the tree. You'll use this measurement to cut your quilt batting to ensure it is long enough to encircle the tree. Next, apply the quilt batting to the trunk of the tree. A 4 to 6 inch wide strip is sufficient. This acts to block channels through furled bark, forcing the female crawlers over the sticky barrier to their doom. Ensure the batting is level and encompasses the entire tree. Cellophane is then wrapped over top of the quilt batting. This helps to add pressure to the batting, forcing it into bark crevices and ensures that it stays on the tree. Two to three wraps is necessary and make sure that it is under tension to avoid future sags and droopiness. Also make sure that it fully covers the quilt batting. This cellophane layer will be what the sticky tanglefoot barrier is applied to and needs to be securely fastened to the tree. It helps to cut the cellophane with a box cutter rather than tearing or ripping the cellophane to complete the layer. Following up with several wraps of packing tape ensures the trap stays put and also further acts as a good surface to apply the tangle foot to. Now it's time to apply the tangle foot. Keep in mind, tangle foot and other similar products are very thick and gooey and it may take several practice runs to get a nice even coat. Apply a 4-6 to six inch wide strip around the entire tree. Ideally you want to work the tangle foot to approximately 1 16th of an inch thick or 1.5 to 2 millimeters. And there you have it, a perfectly installed fall cankerworm sticky band trap. Remove it once it is fully covered with bugs or by mid-December. Thanks for watching this City of Toronto Forest Healthcare production.